Hey, what's going on? Hope everyone's doing well out there. You know, I don't like making these kinds of videos, but sometimes you're forced to. And plus I have a little bit of a personal issue with this person as well. But every video that I make kind of proves a point, don't you think? So how am I going to do this? Well, instead of inconsistently uh, messing up things. So here's point taken number one. Thoughts? impressions with a question mark would you spend the hundred dollar plus on a mesorecto 112 celestian gold or on the 200 dollar harley benton 212 cab leave your comments down below well here's a problem here that meza cab did not come with a celestian gold speaker therefore to do a comparison as far as the celestian gold or the speaker that comes with that is a celestian vintage 30 all right wouldn't you have to have original equipment to really do an accurate comparison as far as uh wanting to spend the difference in the money between a harley benton and the meza so therefore this is basically a useless video the cab has been modified it doesn't consist the celestian vintage 30 that it came with So at this point, he is adjusting several of the knobs on the Marshall head as he's playing through the Harley Benton cab. So again, adjusting the Marshall head while playing through the Meza 112 cab, how is this supposed to be accurate? So throughout the demonstration between the two cabs, I did not change or alter the volume in any way. I did not raise it. I did not lower it. Uh, that's basically the original off of the original file. And yeah, he thinks everyone can hear him while he does whatever he's doing. Now, 
as you've seen, he's adjusting the head during both examples, the Meza Boogie and the Harley Benton. Well, in this case, the Harley Benton, then the Meza Boogie. How can that be accurate as far as trying to do a comparison between the two while you're not showing the settings? Nobody knows if the same settings were used from one cab to another cab as you're adjusting them uh, and everyone can see you do this. So as far as that part of the video going, uh, yeah, that's very inaccurate as far as trying to uh, do a comparison between one thing or another thing. I mean, wouldn't you say? So what I ended up doing is taking the left and right channels and separating them between the Harley Benton and the Meza cab. Now, it still is no comparison between the two of them. You have a Meza, which is quality, and you have Harley Benton, which is something that just works. The problem with this is adjusting the head during playback of the loop on both the Harley Benton cab and the Meza cab and not showing if the head was set for both cabs the same way. So there really is no comparison here. This video is basically another one of his videos where he's putting his foot up his ass. And I think he likes to do this. I think he likes to see um, other people kind of like either poke fun or look at what he's doing and say, why are you doing this? You know, for someone that keeps on saying, I do have the ability to clean these up, or clean instruments up, uh, despite what some mentally unstable individuals think about my uh, ability to work on instruments. You know, he really doesn't make himself look very well as far as being some type of a guitar tech. Uh, this review is a, this review, as far as a comparison, is nothing. It means nothing, it shows nothing, and it proves nothing, especially the way that he did it. Sorry, man, you suck.